Good morning and welcome to Full Circle Ozarks. Well, good morning, friends. Welcome back to Full Circle Ozarks. I've got a few minutes this morning I can spend down at the sawmill again. I did get these uh, support beams here going up on both sides in the front and both sides in the back. I was able to get those. I will, uh, I will show you what that looks like here in just a moment as I was putting them up. As I was putting the ones on up on the front, those little, little pieces of wood are a little bit heavier than what they would look like. So uh, I tried one approach up front, just setting it on the ladder, then trying to hold it in place, getting the screw started. That's the way I've done the front two. And uh, that worked okay, but they were getting heavy. And I tried a different approach on the back. So I'll show you what all that looks like here in just a moment as I was putting those up. And then after I show you that, I think what we're going to do, I'm going to come back over here and we're going to put some uh, support beams going this way on these posts here.
Well, those braces should help out a whole lot. I got all four of them up, but I, I just like the looks of these, these timber here. But man, those timbers were heavy. Uh, doing it by yourself. I tried one approach, just picking it up, putting it on the ladder and trying to hold it up there. And uh, they got kind of heavy doing that. This last method, using that brace, that worked pretty good. I want to make those out of two by six. Let me, let me walk down here and show you what I want to do. I want to do another beam like this, but I'm going to make it out of two by six. And the reason I'm making them out of two by sixes uh, versus six by sixes, the six by sixes will always be seen. So looking at the front of the mill, I just like the way that looks there. But as I get ready to put it, the ones up on the back, they will go on the inside about right. Something uh, like this right here. And uh, this wall here will be covered and this wall here will be covered so by putting the uh, support beams on the back on the back side here like there'll be another one that's going to go across like this way here you won't be able to even see those once this wall here is covered so so anyway I thought I'd just make those out of two by sixes and I'll do the same thing over here I need to make one, put a support beam across this way here. And another support beam will go about like that. That should definitely help to give the uh, sawmill shed a little bit more sheer strength. Uh, I don't know that I truly would need those, but I've got the two by sixes, so I think I'm just going to get those cut and get those installed. That's got those cut out. Let me uh, see if I can get them put up now. I think that looks pretty good guys what do you think now again I'm putting the two by sixes up this way here because there will be a wall out here so you'll never see those but uh, I think that's going to add uh, quite a bit of structural support too so let me get the others up now
Well, that's two up. I'm blocking the way it looks. One more to go, let's get her done. That, my friends, it's done. And again, I really, really like the way this is start steadying this thing here up now. Uh, my next step is to mill some tuba fours. Let me come down there and talk to you. The next thing I need to do is mill some two befores to go across and to have something to attach the sheet metal to. Uh, I'm out of uh, utility poles. I've checked with the uh, utility company a couple of times and they're out. They, they, had, they had four and I said I'd be right there to get them. Someone still beat me to them and that's okay. That's, that's the name of that game. But you know, on top of that, when I was working on the sawmill just the other day, while Cotton Top was painting the, the chicken coop, the, uh, I noticed that the belts were pretty much wore out and I've got new belts coming. Hopefully they will be here later today. So I don't know if I'm gonna mill this afternoon or mill tomorrow, but, uh, but I gotta get the two befores milled, get them, get them up, then we'll be, be ready for the sheet metal. So we're making progress. Folks, thank you so much for taking time out of your busy schedule watching our videos. It means the world to us. Take care, God bless, and we'll see you again on the next Full Circle Ozarks.